वेलकम टू वंडर्स लेट सब्सक्राइब टू आर टेलीग्राम चैनल गिवन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन टू अपडेट्स एंड स्टडी मटेरियल्स टॉपिक फॉर टुडेज क्विज इज फर्स्ट अक्टूबर करंट अफेयर्स 2019 क्वेश्चन नंबर 1 व्हाट इज द थीम ऑफ द 2019 एडिशन ऑफ वर्ल्ड रेबीज डे डब्ल्यू आर डी ऑप्शन ए एंड रेबीज बाय कैंपेनिंग ऑप्शन बी रेबीज वैक्सीनेट टू एलिमिनेट ऑप्शन सी rabies defeat this horrifying disease option d rabies educate vaccinate eliminate the correct answer is option b rabies vaccinate to eliminate the world rabies day wrd is celebrated annually on 28th of september to raise awareness about rabies prevention and to highlight progress in defeating this horrifying disease the day also marks the anniversary of the of the death of french chemist and microbiologist louis pasteur who developed the first rabies vaccine the 2019 theme is rabies vaccinate to eliminate question number 2 which assam district has launched plans for plastic campaign option a karbi anglong option b dhemaji option c bangai gaon option d golpara the correct answer is option c bangai gaon in assam in order to gradually collect and remove the harmful plastics from the ecosystem bongai gaon district administration is going to launch a campaign plants for plastic tomorrow the campaign aims to encourage people to collect and remove plastic from their houses commercial establishments and educational institutions under this unique initiative any person can deposit 1 kg plastic in the municipality office and get a valuable sapling for free Question number 3 Who among the following became the first Indian woman javelin thrower to enter the final at the world championship Option A Anjali Devi Option B Anurani Option C Archana Susitran Option D Jisna Matthew The correct answer is Option B Anurani Anurani went the distance on Monday as she set a new javelin national record with a massive 62.43 meters throw at the ongoing IAAF World Athletics Championships in Doha. Question number 4. Which of the following statements is slash are right about the ease of doing business survey I the World Bank creates ease of doing index to it compares 190 economies around the world 3 India ranks 75th in TH survey. Option A only i option b both 1 and 3 option c both 1 and 2 option d all the above the correct answer is option c both 1 and 2 the world bank creates the ease of doing business index The Doing Business Survey presents quantitative indicators on business regulation and the protection of property rights that can be compared across 190 economies in the world. India ranks 77th in the list with New Zealand, Singapore and Denmark occupying the first 3 positions. Question number 5. What is the name of the Skopne class submarine that has been commissioned by the Union Defence Minister Rajnath Singh on September 29, 2019? Option A INS Khanderi Option B INS Chakra Option C INS Sindhu Ratna Option D INS Arihant The correct answer is Option A INS Khanderi The Union Defence Minister Rajnath Singh has commissioned India's second indigenously built Skopne class submarine INS Khanderi to the Indian Navy on September 29, 2019 at an event held at the Majagon Dock in Mumbai. INS Khanderi, built as part of the Project 75 of the Indian Navy, is a diesel electric submarine designed by French company DCNS and was being manufactured at Majagon Dock in Mumbai. 
Question number 6. On whose birth anniversary did the Central Bank of Nepal release three commemorative coins? Option A. B. R. Ambedkar. Option B. Mahatma Gandhi. Option C. Begum Hazarat Mahal. Option D. Guru Nanak Dev. The correct answer is Option D. Guru Nanak Dev. To commemorate the birth anniversary of Guru Nanak Dev, the Central Bank of Nepal has released three coins of denominations NPR, Nepali rupees, 100, 1000 and 2500. Question number 7. Where was the 7th World Hindu Economic Forum 2019 held? Option A. Maharashtra. Option B. Uttar Pradesh. Option C. Kerala. Option D. Madhya Pradesh. The correct answer is Option D. Madhya Pradesh. An e cigarette, also known as e cigarettes, e cigs, vape pens, or vapor cigarettes, is a handheld battery powered vaporizer that simulates smoking and provides some of the behavioral aspects of smoking without burning tobacco. The studies conducted on e-cigarettes has estimated that it exposes humans to various harmful elements like diacetyl and nitrosamines, which causes popcorn lung and altering DNA, respectively. Question number 8. Who won the MP Birala Memorial Award 2019? Option A. Jayant Narlikar. Option B. Thanu Padmanabhan. Option C. M. S. Raghunathan. Option D. Govind Swaroop. The correct answer is Option B. Thanu Padmanabhan. Renowned physicist Thanu Padmanabhan won the MP Birala Memorial Award 2019 for his contributions in cosmology. His lecture The Gravity and the Cosmos talks about the role that is played by gravity in shaping the universe. The MP Birala Memorial Award was introduced in the year 1993 in recognition of the excellence in research in astrophysics, space science, astronomy and related areas. Question number 9. The Batukamma Festival is a flower festival celebrated in the state of underscore. Option A. Assam. Option B. Telangana. Option C. Uttar Pradesh. Option D. Bihar. The correct answer is Option B. Telangana. Batukamma festival is a flower festival celebrated as per Shatavahana calendar for nine days starting Bhadrapat Purnami till Durgashtami. Batukamma represents the cultural spirit of Telangana. Batukamma is a beautiful flower stack, arranged with different unique seasonal flower. Most of the flowers with medicinal properties are used in Batukamma. In Telugu, Batukamma means Mother Goddess come alive. Question number 10. Name the state government that has launched India's first emissions trading scheme, ETS, to combat particulate air pollution. Option A. Gujarat. Option B. Kerala. Option C. Tamil Nadu. Option D. Karnataka. The correct answer is Option A. Gujarat. The Gujarat state government has launched India's first trading program called the Emissions Trading Scheme, ETS, in Surat, Gujarat to combat particulate air pollution. The Emissions Trading Scheme, ETS, is an initiative of the Gujarat Pollution Control Board, GPCB. It is a market-based system where the state government sets a cap on the emissions and allows industries to buy and sell permits, in kilograms, to stay below the cap. Question number 11. What is the name of the new mineral that has been recently discovered in South Africa? Option A. Tinnunculite. Option B. Nixnite. Option C. Bazinga. Option D. Goldschmidtite. The correct answer is 
Option D. Goldschmidtite, a new mineral known as Goldschmidtite has been discovered inside a diamond unearthed from a mine in South Africa. The mineral has been named after Victor Moritz Goldschmidt, a Norwegian scientist who has been acknowledged as the founder of modern geochemistry. Goldschmidtite has higher concentrations of niobium, potassium and the rare earth elements like lanthanum and cerium and the rest of the mantle is dominated by other elements, such as magnesium and iron. It was estimated that the mineral was formed about 170 kilometers beneath the earth's surface at temperatures reaching nearly 1200 Oc. Question number 12. The Yukon category of red-fronted brown lemur is underscore. Option A. Extinct. Option B. Critically endangered. Option C. Endangered. Option D. Near threatened. The correct answer is. Option D. Near threatened, red fronted brown lemur found in western and eastern Madagascar. These are threatened by slash and burn agriculture, illegal logging, hunting, trapping. Question number 13. Who becomes the first Indian to have a minor planet named after him? Option A. Kishori Amonkar. Option B. Bhim Singh Joshi. Option C. Jasraj. Option D. Ratan Mohan Sharma The correct answer is Option C. Jasraj, the International Astronomical Union has named a minor planet 2006 VP32, number 3,128 as Pandit Saraj located in the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter after Indian musician Pandit Jasraj, an Indian classical vocalist. Pandit Jasraj is famous for Hindustani classical music and has won several awards like the Padma Vibhushan, 2000, Padma Bhushan, 1990, Sangeet Natak Academy Award, 1987, Padma Shri, 1975, etc. Question number 14. Recently a new mineral gold schmittite has been discovered inside a diamond unearthed from A mine and underscore. Option A. South Africa. Option B. Egypt. Option C. Saudi Arabia. Option D. India. The correct answer is. Option A. South Africa. The mineral has been named Goldschmidtite, after Victor Moritz Goldschmidt. It has an unusual chemical signature for a mineral from Earth's mantle. It is dark green with an adamantine luster. Question number 15. He railway passengers of India's first private train underscore will be compensated in case of any delays. Option A. Lucknow Delhi. Option B. Chandigarh Mumbai. Option C. Jaipur Kolkata. Option D. Delhi Ahmedabad. The correct answer is Option A. Lucknow, Delhi. The passengers will be compensated with an amount of 100 rupees if the delay is for over an hour. The new Tejas Express will run on New Delhi Lucknow route for six days a week. Just like in flights, meals will be served by onboard service staff by trolleys. Question number 16. Underscore and Ford Motor Company have signed a definitive agreement to create a joint venture that will develop, market and distribute Ford brand vehicles in India. Option A. A. Dot Mahindra and Mahindra, m, m Option B. Maruti Suzuki. Option C. Alpine. Option D. Tata Motors. The correct answer is Option A. A. Dot Mahindra and Mahindra, m, m This is expected to be operational by mid 2020, subject to regulatory approvals. The joint venture will be responsible for growing the Ford brand in India. m, &M will hold 51% stake in the new venture, while Ford will hold the remaining 49% stake. Question number 17 NBCC, India 
has signed a memorandum of understanding, MO, with Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, MYAS, to provide project management consultancy for development of National Sports University in underscore. Option A. Manipur. Option B. Nagaland. Option C. Assam. Option D. Up. The correct answer is Option A. Manipur. It is presently functional from its temporary campus at the Khuman Lumpak Sports Complex. It will be the first one of its kind to promote sports education. The university will be empowered to grant degrees, diplomas and certificates. Question number 18. General Assembly of Commonwealth Parliamentary Conference was recently held in underscore. Option A. Uganda. Option B. South Korea. Option C. Pakistan. Option D. USA. The correct answer is Option A. Uganda. The Indian parliamentary delegation was led by Lok Sabha Speaker Om Bidala. This was in news as the Pakistani delegation raised the issue of Kashmir there claiming that Indian military forces have seized Kashmir. Earlier, Pakistan had raised the same issue during the 4th South Asian Speakers Summit. Question number 19. To commemorate the 150th birth anniversary of Gandhiji, the government of the Republic of Underscore will issue a postage stamp on October 2, 2019. Option A. Pakistan. Option B. Sri Lanka. Option C. Uzbekistan. Option D. Bhutan. The correct answer is Option C. Uzbekistan. The stamp is to be issued by its Ministry of Information Technologies and Communication. Each stamp costs around 47 rupees, 6,200 Uzbek sums. The circulation of the stamp is about 5,000 copies. Question number 20. The World Trade Organization has lowered its growth projection for world merchandise trade for 2019 to underscore. Option A. 1.2%. Option B. 2.3%. Option C. 3.6%. Option D. 4.0%. The correct answer is Option A. 1.2% This decision is mainly due to trade tensions and sluggish global economy. Also, rising protectionism and escalating trade tensions between countries is partly responsible for the slowdown. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonderslate app now, link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.